It isn't very smart to piss off a guy who thinks about killing people for a living. You know what else isn't very smart? You were there with him, and you let those words come out of his mouth. I trust Will to speak for himself. Evidently, you shouldn't. I'm just happy the story wasn't about Abigail Hobbs. Well, then it's a victory. So Abigail Hobbs wants to go home. Let's take her home. What Abigail wants and what she needs are different things. Taking her out of a controlled environment would be reckless. You said she was practical. And that could just mean she has a dissociative disorder. You take her home, she may experience intense emotions, respond aggressively, or reenact some aspect of the traumatic event without even realizing it. Where, where do you weigh in on this, Doctor? Dr. Bloom is right. But there is a scenario where revisiting the trauma event could help Abigail heal and actually prevent denial. And we have a difference of opinion, therefore I'm going to choose the opinion that best serves my agenda. I need to know if you're right about the copycat, Will. We have no way of knowing what's waiting for her when she goes home. <laughs>